hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix ARK survival evolved low level fatal error the UE4 shooter game has crashed let's fix it guys method on you just need to go to search menu and type cmd right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes check my video description for this command just to copy and paste it and press enter after finishing this command just to close stuff here and go to search menu and type edit power plan click on open it and select change advanced power settings and scroll down and expand the power processor power management and you can able to see processor performance boost mode set this to disabled and select apply and then maximum processor state set this maximum processor state to 95 and select apply and apply it's gonna be as 95 percentage and now we after changing these two options just to close stuff here and restart your PC after restarting you can launch the game and check if the problem solved or not if not method 2 you just need to update the graphics card driver to do this just need to check my video description for these links Nvidia and AMD scroll down and you just need to select the graphics card model if you don't know then go to search menu and type device manager click on device manager and expand the display adapter section and in here you can able to see my graphics card model name in my case i have a rtx 5080 after knowing that just to close stuff here and select here g4 selective model series selective graphics card model and select your windows and select your language and select find option just need to download next to GeForce game ready driver select the view option select the download option and download the driver guys after getting download and click double click on it and start the installation after finish installing you just need to restart your PC and your problem should be fixed for AMD users you just need to scroll down and select here browse product graphics select the graphics card model over here After selecting it, select Summit option. And now you just need to expand it, depends on where system. After that, scroll down, you can able to see recommended driver, guys. You just need to download the recommended driver. Select the download option next to the recommended. And after getting download done, you just need to double click to install it. After the installation done, restart. After restarting, your problem should be fixed. Don't forget to leave a like, guys. Thank you.